Hey everybody, I just got back from the art store and I wanted to share with you guys some of the basic paints you will need when you're just getting started. I've had a lot of people ask me when they're just starting which colors to get and what supplies are necessary because when you go to the store and you go online there's a lot of stuff that you just don't need. So we'll jump right into it. Um, first you want to get some big titanium white and Mars black or ivory black. You're going to use those a lot. I use CAD yellow medium a lot um, to mix with other colors to brighten it up. With the yellow family, you want to get CAD yellow light and CAD yellow medium. Those are two different hues. You're going to use them both. With blues, you're going to want to have five different kinds. You're going to want to have ultramarine blue, cobalt blue, phthalo blue, cerulean blue, and prussian blue. Different hues, they're going to have different effects when you are mixing them with different colors. As far as the green family, you want to do the phthalo green. You can pretty much get any green you want by mixing that phthalo green with either the yellow family, or you can even get an olive color by mixing it with black. I have the dioxine purple. I don't really use that that much, but it's a good, good thing to have as far as just having it around when you need purple. You want to make sure you get crimson. I love crimson. I use it all the time. It's that deep blood red. Cad red medium and cad red light. They're similar but very different when in application. The only one I didn't get today was orange because I just don't use it much. And if I'm going to do an orange tone, I will typically mix one of these with yellow. Um, the one I did add that I don't usually get is this Theo Violet, which is actually a magenta because I love magenta. And then the last three you want to make sure you have are yellow ochre, burnt sienna, and burnt umber. Those are going to be for the nice natural looking neutral tones. Um, yeah, you get those colors and you can basically mix any color under the rainbow that you're trying to do. So, happy painting.